Hello, David Morgan, founder of SilverInvestor.com at Silver-Investor.com. Responding to this video, I was one of the first to put this out on my website and also our email list that you can uh, get on for free if you wish. We have two lists, actually. We have the member section and the paid part of the website. And we also have a free email list that you're welcome to get on. Uh, it's once a week as you do some economic updates. And we usually provide uh, really useful information. Obviously, if you don't like it, you can opt out at any time. The reason I'm doing this video is to point out a couple things. One, the amount of silver used per capita in China is roughly uh, five years ago, 170th the amount used in the Western nations. In other words, just the normal American or Canadian will use 70 times more silver in a year just in their basic daily life, meaning because they buy an iPod or they have a TV or phones or the amount of electricity they use or stove or anything that uses electrical or electronics or using silver to some limited extent. And Chinese as a whole are using 170th of that amount. Now it's moved up since then because China is becoming more and more westernized all the time. But what this video points out is China is being reintroduced into silver as an investment. But I also want to point out something very interesting about Chinese silver investment, and that is a lot of the public that was in this video are not buying physical silver. Now, a lot are. I want to be very clear. But the easiest form for them to buy is paper silver, and the paper silver is offered through their banking establishments. So I just want to caution everybody that the paper silver game is not only played in the Western Hemisphere and in the European countries, it's also being played in the Asian countries as well. I think everyone that knows me even slightly knows where I stand. I stand on the fact that you should have the physical form first. If you want to diversify outside of your core investment that you know you own and touch and it's physical, it certainly it's your prerogative to do so. So hopefully I brought a little more light to the subject of Chinese silver investing.